My name's Louise. I would like to donate a piece of my personal chalk in case you need to outline a body. <laughs> that was the best timing ever. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Um, <laughs> perfection. Absolute perfection. Um, hi, everyone. Okay, well, that was a great start. So we're just gonna keep going with it. Oh, there we go. So we're, we're just gonna start. Um, what's up? I hope everyone's doing good. I feel like my music is super loud on my headset. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if anything can top that moment. Like, it was perfect. Okay, so we're starting a new farm. Um, because I have plans for this. So, hi, again, um, new farm, but I have, I have a fun new mod I'm gonna mess with. Um, so first thing is, oops, there you go. I'm trying to figure out how I want to go about, if I want to do community center route or if I want to do the Jojo Mart route. I had a poll on my Twitter and it was exactly one vote for each um, so that didn't help me so then there was that but now i also have another mod that i've added that um is gonna make romancing our our dear dear sebastian a little a little different um i have added the sebastian yandere mod <laughs> which can get a bit crazy from what I've read um, but it'll be slow burn so there's nothing really to worry about right now I have a Jojo Mart route running on my switch which it's actually like it made the game way different in the sense of I didn't have to collect and save things I could simply go out and 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 sell all my stuff. If I wanted to farm and sell everything I could, I felt a little bit more like free to do what I wanted in a way. I got more done in a year than I've ever done on any save file. I don't know what I'm putting her in. She needs clothes. Uh, what shirt? What shirt? I thought I added stuff for clothing mods, but I guess I didn't. Oh. That's like the go-to. That one's kind of cute. We'll do that one. She wore pants. Pants. Um. Let's see. Eye color. Hair color. Just give her like okay. I don't want it to like feel too crazy. As I give her pink hair, kind of pink hair. Oh, those are your pants. No, I want your pants to stay blue. <laughs> so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, with the Jojo route. I want that cat. Why is it only showing half its face? I guess it's just something with the overlay. Okay, we need a farm name. Um, I'm so bad at naming my farms. And a favorite thing. What's the favorite thing? Coffee. <laughs> That's accurate for me. Farm name. Um, hmm. I don't know which route we're taking, so I'm kind of like... I don't know if I should, you know, I don't want to name it something and then it just, you know, not, not match. We also have to pick what kind of farm. I don't know if I want a forest farm. 
I don't need the four corners, and a beach farm is just not in my wheelhouse. I'm not good enough to play that. Hilltop could be fun. I haven't done a hilltop farm in a while. Let's do that. Because... I don't know. I don't know what route we're going to take. Um... I really- I'm drawing a blank on a farm name, you guys. My brain. Uh... Old Farm Farm. That's what we're gonna name it. It's Old Farm Farm. On the hill. It's fine. It's fine. Um... Let's skip the intro. We've been here for the intro. We've done it. My computer is slow when it comes to this because I have too many mods. More than likely. My computer hates it. Let's see. Let's do this. There it is. Ooh, I forgot I had mods to make the house cute too. Very, very cute. I'm okay with that. I received parsnips. Here's a little something to get you started. Ah, oh, we love free stuff. And then the volume went down way low. Oops, breaking stuff. Okay. So. Let's zoom out a smidge. We are on our farm. We gotta clear out some space for these parsnips. It's been so long since I've done a hilltop farm, I've kind of forgotten the layout of it. <laughs> Aside from the fact that it's on a hill. <laughs> but that's okay. So, first things first is we have to plant this stuff and then we will go meet some people in town. What I have learned with this mod for Sebastian is I feel like I should give attention and gifts to everybody. Mostly because I want to see if doing that sends him into a just spiral right away. Or if that's something I have to wait long term on. I don't know how long it takes for him to go full on, like, kind of crazy. So, that's the plan. Wait, that's three, four, five, fifteen. Oops, I don't want that one. Two. I'll get rid of it in a minute. I forget that my overlay. Uh, kind of. Sebastian's gonna be the biggest problem in general with his mod but I also am definitely going to make it worse I want to get the ultimate crazy like slow burn obsessed love that he he could possibly have which I say that now I might truly regret that uh, as as the relationship progresses um like i said uh, from what i've read on the mod and from bits i've seen of other people using the mod it has its moment but um i'm i'm invested i've had a slight obsession with finding these mods and watching people do playthroughs of them why? I don't know. Um, I guess it's just my weird brain. I I don't know if his mod per se uh, does it. I, I haven't dug that deep into it. I know there's like, I'm, I'm sure he will do some threatening of others. Um, I know there is one, I believe. Where, where it happens. I believe um, Elliot has 
the Yandere mod where it gets it gets very dark. His is a lot. Um but we'll just have to see. Wow, really? Copper ore already? What fun. Um, I should go meet people since I should meet them. Also, we gotta go find our boy and I don't remember if he leaves his house yet. So maybe I should have just immediately gone up there because like everyone matters, but Sebastian's end goal. He's, he's end game. And then who knows, if I ever make enough money, we, we can see how far he'll spiral if we divorce. <laughs> I shouldn't think like that, but I kind of do. Is he still hiding away in his room? Hey, let me in. Leave your room. Hey. Psst. Psst. Come here. I love at the beginning of the game, though, for a while, I'm going to be the one stalking him, <laughs> waiting outside his room for him to, to appear. Sebastian! Ugh, we'll meet everyone else in the house first. I did a, a, a test because none of his, um, because he'll have different dialogue, of course, but none of it, I think, goes into effect until two hearts um everything else will be the same old same old with him uh until two hearts i did a test run on a other save i have um and immediately two hearts and he was just like you should come around more blush blush i'm like this is only two hearts sir don't blush at me. Oh my gosh, Sebastian, I... I don't remember what day he leaves. It's Monday. I thought he leaves his house at like three. Let's go see Lioness, I guess, because he's up in his tent as per usual. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, Lioness is down there. What did I just hit? Oh, I had my pick. It's like I hit something. Linus, I did not just try and take your tent down, I swear. A stranger, hello. Don't mind me. Just out here, living alone. You'll see me a lot. I'm gonna be around here a lot. Well, I have nothing good. Oh, what? I can't remember my buttons. Okay, I don't think anyone has... Yeah, no, no questy quests. I don't have like any good gifts for Sebastian. It's two. I think three o'clock is when he starts like making his move to his kitchen. You would think I'd have his schedule completely, um, you know, memorized, but I don't. I wish I did. No, oh, Mario already left. Demetrius? Don't get in my way, sir. Here for your stepson. What a thrilling first day of game. I'm just waiting for Sebastian to actually do something. Maybe this isn't the day he leaves his room? Yes, it is. Are you leaving your room? Or are you going to go sit on your couch? Oh, he's leaving the room. I'm excited. Oh. Hello, Boo. You don't know this now, but soon you'll be obsessed. And I'm going to stalk you until then. And then I'm going to be kind of creeped out because then I will stop stalking you and you will do that in return. Out of all the places you could have lived, you chose Pelican Town. Yeah, well. I did. But we talked. He knows my name. New Farmer. Now we can meet everyone else. And kind of... Slowly get to know them. Still try and figure out what we're going to do about this... Thing. This thing. The community center. Um, I thought Haley was up here. But apparently the girl's not. Uh, 
what did I have in my pocket that I didn't want? Throw the stuff away. I need this flower. It's important. Okay. Um, there's Harvey, Caroline. Actually, I need to befriend you anyways, because I want your recipe. That sounded weird. Um, <laughs> I want her uh, tea sapling recipe. That's what I want. George, my dear sweet George. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people. My name's George, by the way, no buzz off. George, I hope I can be half the grumpy old person you are one day. Truly. It, it's such a goal. Evelyn, come back. Chase down old lady. Oh, yeah, I forgot. This mod makes her look like she's ready to be the next Hokage. <laughs> Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. We all know she's the one truly running the town, not Lewis. Oh, hello, I'm Penny. What's up, Penny? Maru, I already met you. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. Oh. That took me a minute to read. My my brain stopped working. Is Harvey still out here? Yes, and Vincent. Even better. Hello, child. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Sure. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. I have to say, this this portraits mod gives Harvey a look. I, I don't know where I was getting with that one. It was just one of those things. Sam. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Leah, everyone's just out now. It's nice to meet you. Oh, I guess I... Uh, you picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. I'm not talking to everyone enough, apparently. There's Pierre. Good thing I didn't have to buy anything from you. Hey, it's Miss Luna, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Yes, and then you'll sell it off as your own and then I will have to um, come burn down your shop. But let's hope it never gets to that point. <laughs> it could. Oh, and here's our cranky boy Shane. I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? I'm just saying hi. It's not like I proposed to you right on the spot and told you to take me away. Jeez. Hey, kid. The name's Pam. I love Pam. What? There's something about Pam. Nothing like a sip of the old... The old... What? Nothing like a sip of the good stuff to warm these old bones. Wow, that shouldn't have taken me that long to read. Gus. Hello. I'm Gus. Chef and owner of the Stardew... Star Drop Saloon. One day I will learn to read, I swear. Ooh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. It is where you work. I'm I'm here to, to say hi to you, Emily. Okay. I'm making good progress meeting everyone. Usually it takes me a bit. The only person I did not get around to meeting that I probably won't is I can probably get in and meet Haley real fast maybe if I'm lucky no oh yes Haley's in there um I didn't meet Abigail because she was held up in her room oh you're that new farm girl or whatever aren't you huh oh I'm Haley hmm <laughs> if it weren't for those horrendous clothes you might actually be pretty actually never mind I swear. Um, I swear. Can I get next door before they lock their door? Haha, <laughs> I did. Sam, I'm in your house after the doors are locked. Vincent, move. Tiny child. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I am Jody. It's quite a little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. I don't know how much I could change things, except bring absolute chaos to the valley. That sounds like fun. Let's do that. 
Um, people are sleeping. I'm gonna dig through the trash cans. That's trash. I don't need that. Um, I actually don't have the pockets to do anything. Clint, I haven't met you yet. Come here. What's up? Oh, I didn't read what you said. My bad. Uh, I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Cool. Cool, Clint. Does Clint judge me if he sees me digging through the trash can? I don't think Clint has ever caught me digging through a garbage can. But like most people are like, ew, don't do that. I'm kind of like, is Clint going to fully judge me? Clint is oblivious to everything I do. I'm not mad. That's fine. Um, who am I missing? Who did I miss? I know I missed Abigail and Elliot. Maru, Jazz, and Willie, which I won't meet Willie for like another day or two. So they're on my list for tomorrow. Perfect. I can do that. Maru I should be able to meet pretty early in the day if I go straight there. Elliot. Elliot's hit or miss. I will either find Elliot or I won't find Elliot. It depends on how that goes. Um, okay, let's walk around the farm real fast. My curiosity is piqued that I don't remember what the farm looks like. Grandpa, I forgot what the farm looked like. Lots of stairs, that's what it is. Um, breaking things, breaking things. I forgot. Farming is not all it's cracked up to be on this one. But I think there's a spot for me to mine. That'll like replenish itself. If I'm correct, I think it's over here. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Just break everything in my path. Uh, that one. It's so freaking dark, I can't see. God, I have a lot of cleaning to do. <laughs> Wrong thing. Breaking stuff. I just want to get through. Is that so much to ask? There. Okay. Yeah, so I have like, wow, and a lot of those. That's actually interesting. I'll have to dig all those up tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I have a little like spot that I can use for mining for the next little bit, which is nice. That was the one thing I did like about this uh, type of farm. Oh my gosh, I keep getting stuck. It's just getting around is kind of a pain until it's cleared up. Really? Really? Everything's in my way. I don't like it. Is that just... No, it's just me getting in my own way. Um, okay. And I think that's just a way to get over to uh, Grandpa's Shrine. So, that's that's fine. We're going to sell some stuff. Uh, I'm really leaning towards doing the Jojo route. Honestly. It was one thing in there. Um, oh, I didn't look at this. Run off the land, blah, blah, blah. Uh, weather report. What's the weather for tomorrow? Clear and sunny. I do not need to be up. There we go. It's lit up. I can see. Yes, we can sleep for the night. Day one was more of a success than I thought it would be. We met a lot of people. We met our 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 future husband Sebastian which is great okay it's gonna rain tomorrow and fortune teller is telling me that things don't want to kill me today perfect Clint hi there good morning oh wow this is fast I didn't know that you've been breaking some rocks and opening and finding ore that's good 
I mean, it was an accident. I dug it up out of the ground, but okay. <laughs> um, if you want to get the most out of your ores, you can find... You find you'll need a furnace. Okay, furnace. Just so happens I have an extra set of blueprints lying around. Here you go. Da 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 da. So, I learned how to craft a furnace, which is good. Probably set him up over by the little spot. You're heading home. Bye, Clint. I, this is early for you. Usually you don't open the store for a while. I want to check my mail. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. I'm already getting spam mail. <laughs> Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you, Willie. I actually need to go to the beach because I need to go down that way to talk to um, Elliot. That's the boy we're talking to. That's the boy we're going to meet. So. We have to do that. We have to go to Marnie's. Meet Marnie and Yaz. Or Jazz. Sorry. Jazz. I don't know. That other kid in town. We could call her that. Okay. Um, I don't know why I'm going this way. Because I can't. Of course. Oh my gosh. I'm thinking rainy day is spent cleaning this absolute terrible thing. I need to just make a way down there, though. That's what I need to do. It's just... I didn't mean to do that. I don't want to water the rock. I can't. I have to go this way. Oh my gosh. The choices I made were not of good ones. All these rocks. Okay. okay. Cleaning up. A little bit of cleanup. It goes a long way. We'll get the whole farm cleaned up pretty fast. Because it'll drive me nuts if we don't. So. Um, okay. Also, I guess I should go. I don't know. I haven't decided. I don't have the money anyways to unlock anything for the Jojo route. Really, Marty? Open your door. Let me in to meet you. Um, I couldn't do the Jojo route right now anyways. So I guess the least we'll be able to do is open the community center, then make a choice. Oh, it's still locked because I'm impatient. There we go. Marty. No, don't go in your room. Mary Luce told me about told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. Uh, I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. Good to know. Let me meet the child in your house. She doesn't say much. <laughs> Hi. That's it. That that's all I came here for. Was that. Okay, so the only person I need to meet is um, Elliot and Willie. Elliot and Willie, let's go. Vincent. See nothing. Don't judge me, child. More trash. I mean, I don't know what I'd expect to find, but... Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. Boy, it is 9.40 in the morning. How many have you had? Sam was probably sneaking them to him. At the breakfast table, just like, here, have more. Uh, our favorite, Willie. My favorite. I love Willie. He's so sweet. Just a crispy, leathery looking sailor. He looks like he's been out in the sun a little too much without sunscreen. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Like, he even looks like that in his little pixel icon. I can't tell if his eyes are shut or if something's wrong with my, uh, portrait mod. I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. Is that why you're spying? Oh no, you have beautiful blue eyes. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Uh, my backpack's full. 
care what you have in a fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Of course I will. If I support anyone in this town, it's you. I have to get rid of something in my backpack. Goodbye, seeds. I need that flower to give to someone as a gift. It's important. There's a good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Yeah, for a small valley like this, there's a lot of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. Oh gosh. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say anyways. Your pappy sounds like an interesting man. Okay. Fast forward that a little bit. Just looking at the ocean. Okay, so now we met Wheelie. Now we gotta go harass Elliot. Speaking of, has he left his... Nope, he hasn't left his cabin. Hey. Elliot, let me in. Ugh. Elliot, I don't have time for this. I have other things I could be doing. Besides waiting on you to leave your house. Lewis. How was your first night in the cottage? Um, fine, actually. It doesn't look as bad as I thought it did. Who else do I need to meet? Oh, I have to go meet Gunther. That's who I have to go meet. I kind of want to wait and meet him when I have... Um a thing, an uh, artifact, that's what it's called. Elliot is still in his house. I'll just keep an eye on the map and track Elliot that way. Also, same with Sebastian. If we notice he leaves the house, um, we'll go see him. I at least need to try and talk to him every day and make me feel better. It make me feel better. Elliot's still in there. I don't know what that, like, one minute would have done. I should talk to everyone, actually. I should be a polite person. The beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. You don't say. You gotta spend time in the sun or else you'll get all pale. Not for the vitamins or, like, the good mental health aspect, but so you can get a sick tan. Oh, Alex. What? I don't remember this. Do you want to hang out with me at the beach sometime? Do you have a bikini? What is this? That must have been... Do I have a mod that adds more dialogue? I think I do. You're... Uh, I must. So I'm... Okay. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. Is that the same rickety old bed that I found grandpa, like, dying in? Because if so, I don't blame him for hating it. Damn, what do you have to say? Hey, don't be snooping around the trailer when I'm out, got it. I can't even get into your house, I don't think. Sorry, but I gotta be cautious with strangers. What is Pam hiding in her house that I can't find? Besides, I guess, maybe Penny living in her house? Is that who you're hiding in there, is Penny? Now I'm interested to talk to all the, like eligible people. Oh, I still have to go meet Abigail. That's who I didn't meet yet. Whoops. I should go meet her. There she is. Oh, I forgot it was um workout class day. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving into that old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Really? Lovely. Introductions. Who am I missing? Elliot. That's who I'm missing, and he's on the beach. I'm on I'm on the move. Elliot, don't don't go anywhere. I'm coming. We gotta be friends so I can move on with everything in my life. Elliot, don't move a muscle. There's a bee on your back. 
Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. You people are talking about me already, I see. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Okay, I guess I can't talk to you anymore since... And he's literally going back in his house. I'm... Wow. That was luck. That I... Was able to... Find him and talk to him. But now I'm invested to talk to everyone else real fast and see if they have something else to say. Because I think I have to do... How to win friends. Give someone a gift. Can I give Sam a flower? Sam, you want a flower? Hmm. It... This is interesting. Just accept the gift and be on your way, sir. Oh, hi. It's good to see you again. Take it easy. Wow. You're a man of not many words. Then that's okay. That's okay. Has Sebastian left his home? No, Sebastian is still held up in his house, but... It's almost three. I believe it is snack time for Sebastian. So he should be leaving his room. I'm a-coming. There's nothing really going on on my farm anyways. I've, I've watered the crops. I just haven't cleaned up anything. And it's gonna rain tomorrow, so even better. I want to do this. But I want that. Uh, choices are gonna have to be made, but what are the choices I'm gonna make? It's that. Yay. You found an artifact. The curator at the local museum might want to know about this. That's exactly what I wanted to do before I went there. This valley has a very vibrant and diverse ecosystem. That's one reason I was excited to move here. That's great. Sebastian. Sebastian. Perfect timing, my good sir. I was thinking, people are like stones skipping over the water. We're gonna get deep in a minute. Eventually, we're going to sink. Oh, nope, we're just gonna get sad. Can I give you a flower? You just take that. I could have given you a rock. Really make you feel like you're sinking. Um, Linus, I mean, I'll say hi. I don't have anything good to give you as a gift, and... Have you come to ridicule me? No! I'm just minding my own business. Okay. This is a great gift. I'm so glad you liked it, because I wasn't going to give it to you, but I did, and now I feel better. Okay, to the farm. How to win friends. Apparently, winning friends gives me money. I'm okay with that. Okay. Off we go. Back to the farm where I have to clean up because it's messy. And I'm sick of not being able to get places. <laughs> what am I stuck on? I actually don't know what's right there that I am stuck on. I need to get... I need to get wood so I can make a chest. That's what I need to do. I'll clean up these. It'd be great if you hit what you were supposed to. I should put the water- oh, I don't have a chest to put the watering can in. That's why I'm doing this. I sometimes forget what I'm doing before I do it. That's a rock. Yeah, this is bothering me in the order it's in. There. Now I'm not going everywhere. I don't want to cut down all the trees. They're kind of pretty. <laughs> they look kind of pretty right now. I say that and then I'm just going to keep running into them and getting mad. We'll pick up some rocks now. Rocks are important to get. Not as important as wood, but you know. Rocks get in the way. And Grandpa's Shrine, where Grandpa will... Casually remind me, hey, I'll be back by year three. Um, fix this place up. It's your job. Which, Grandpa kind of left this place in a whole state of disarray. We'll leave those trees there. Um, can't go that way, so I have to go this way. 
I like the setup of this farm. It's just until I can actually clear everything, it kind of sucks. That's the only thing. This way, can I get over this? Yes. Yes, I can. Um, and break a few more of these. That one. That one. I want to make sure I can fit places. A uh, geode. Um, that's that's what I need. Well, now it's raining the next day, so I won't have to water anything. So I could I could actually fish. I could make some money fishing. It might be worth doing. We need to make money stat. That's the thing. The sooner I make money, the sooner I can upgrade stuff. And that's important. I have a feeling we're going to end up going the Jojo route. I'm not really... I don't know. I just don't feel like this is going to be the most ideal farm for me to grow crops on. So maybe Jojo route is the best. That way I can like get animals and like just focus on growing a few things instead of like all the things I need for the community center. We'll just sell out. That one. Oh, she's getting tired. That's not good. We don't need you being tired tomorrow when it's gonna rain. And I wanna actually get stuff done. This way. Nope, not this way. This way, maybe? So, we'll do that. We'll just plan the Jojo route. This is your maid. Unless I'm convinced otherwise, but I don't think I'm going to be convinced otherwise. My chest. There's nowhere to put said chest. Apparently that's where a chest has to go. God. Okay. Sure. I'm fine with that. Don't need that right now. We put all our stuff away. I will take that piece of wood. Perfect. What did we find? A chewing stick. Why have I... Pretty positive I've never found that. Okay. I don't need to read any of that. To sleep. Take a nap. Mining level one already, and we aren't even in the mine yet. And it's raining. Perfect. Weather report. Tomorrow it's going to be clear and sunny. Fortune teller. Good humor. But I can't get into the mine, so that doesn't really matter. I can at least... I can get all these things and go take them to Gunther. Let's do that. I would like to get around this place. I keep getting stuck. Ugh. And I keep forgetting I can't go that way. Why did I think this was going to be a fun farm to be on? I hate when Stardew just does random sounds. I'm like, I don't know what that was. It was something. I don't know what, but it was something. There we go. Clay. More clay. Probably all clay actually up here. Me thinking it was going to be something good. Oh, clay makes money. A rock. If I wanted a rock, I could have just mined all this, but you know. Get some geodes. I can take those to Clint. I have enough money to do that too. Break all this so then they can start like reforming. Oh my gosh, there we go. That's where I want to be. Got this. Hopefully. I have more rocks than I've ever wanted, but things need rocks. 
please break that. And I think as I progress in the mines, this will um, also like change the ore and stuff. If I remember correctly. That's fine for now. So I'll just check it every couple days and see how it's doing. Actually, I have to clear this up some before I actually no, nothing posted. No one needs my help. No one needs me. Which is fine with me, actually. I don't need these people to be so reliant on me all the time. I have my own business to take care of, too. Not just theirs. Some of their jobs don't even pay that well. Okay. That's... We're gonna sell that. Keep that. Not enough yet. Oh, and the fishing pole. Yeah, I want the fishing pole. Let's put all this other stuff away. We're gonna go fishing. And turn in this stuff to Gunther. And we're gonna take the hoe in case we find something important along the way. And we're gonna talk to people. And apparently pick stuff up. I can give that as a gift to somebody. I don't know who. Probably Haley. Haley likes simple things. I do. More clay to sell, which I didn't even sell. Okay, let's... That's not Haley's house, that's Sam's house. Oh, fun trash. Just what I wanted. Is... Haley, are you still... Girl, come here. I got... I have a dandelion for you. Is that a dandelion? It's... Yeah, it's a dandelion. I... Here. I have things for you. I have gifts. You like gifts? I swear. We'll just go to Clint's. We'll come back and find Haley. We'll take this stuff to, um, what's his face, too? I know who I'm talking about. Gunther, because we haven't met Gunther yet. Okay. Hello, Gunther. The, f the one, the one time we will see him outside of the desk. <laughs> Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. I don't know what kind of accent I'm going for with Gunther. I feel like he, he would be super, like, southern. Maybe it's just the hat and, like, the glasses. But when I do, like, the southern accent, it's, like, southern bell. So he's gonna have... I don't know. We'll see what happens. What's this? Yeah, see, it immediately goes the wrong way. You found something. Let me see it. It doesn't work. These things were not made for me to give them voices. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Now you can have it. Hmm. I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows, if you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Interesting items to send my way, you say? <laughs> Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. I'm gonna forget all these voices I gave these people and it's gonna be different every time I play. Hey, I brought this for you. Here, Gunther, take it. It's gonna go in here. Way over there. Did it. Archaeology, 250. See, Gunther is willing to pay me 250 for the things I dig up in the ground. People want me to give them other things for like nothing. Craft a furnace and Harvest. Harvest the parsnips. Let's see. Okay. Um, process them geodes. Hopefully something good. Uh, yes. I can turn that into Gunther. I can turn that into Gunther. 
That's the same thing as that. I'm okay with that. And I'm okay with that, I guess. Yeah, it's fine. <clears throat> it's fine. Okay. Gunther, I have two more things, and it's not this. Let's do that there, and... What? Green... I don't know how many green things there are. Let's do green there. Try and color coordinate. I think you can, like, move stuff around. Once you, uh... Ooh, there's something over here. It's probably more clay. No, it's a bunch of rocks. I don't have a good gift. But I feel like I need to go talk to people. Pierre, Abigail, Harvey, they're all in the house. It's Gus at the saloon. I s assume Haley is still going to be in her house all day. Because it's raining. I don't really have like any gifts for anyone yet. I'm just trying to give what I have to make friends. And Haley's easy to impress. No, not eat it. <laughs> I brought you a gift, but I ate it right before I gave it to you. I'm sorry. That's such a stupid gift. I'm gonna s fight you. The only thing I like about the town is the beach. Okay, I'm done talking to you. No more gifts for Haley. It never rains in Calico Desert. That's where my friend Sandy lives. Oh, we're talking about Sandy already? I wish I could have visited her today. Well, Pam is probably slightly hungover and can't drive the bus. So, uh, yeah, sorry. Let's see. Cookies! That's always a fun gift. I'm not giving you people my cookies. You threw them away, you do not get them. I'm not gonna give him dirt, though. It's awful cold, isn't it? What a rotten day. When I wake, when I woke up, I heard dripping from somewhere. I think the roof might be leaking. We'll send Alex to fix it. In the old days, George would have scampered right up and fixed it. Oh, Alex is more than capable. Like, bros in here, build in that muscle. Put him on the roof and make him find it. He can do it. I believe in him. Okay. I still have the mod that tells me. I don't remember what the button is. I had a mod that I could press a button and it would tell me who likes that gift or if the person likes it, but I don't remember what button it is and I don't want to break my game. So, I just won't. It's fine. I can sell some stuff at least. I just need- I was gonna give someone cookies, but I'm like, maybe I should keep my cookies. Hello, I'm here to talk to you people. Hey Luna, earlier Sebastian asked me what kind of stuff you liked. It was kind of out of character for him, and I said I didn't know, but I found it so sweet. That's new, for sure. Um, it- it- Interesting. Um, okay. So, yeah. Apparently, our boy Sebastian's already trying to find out what I like. Well, I like the coffees. So. She finds it sweet, though. If you end up dating my brother, take good care of him, okay? What is my heart with Sebastian? He didn't even like the gift I gave him. What? Um, mm. <clears throat> Thank you for the, the, the blessing of dating your brother. Which I... What? Is it because I've talked to him? Where is he? We don't even have a heart with him. We have like the the butt end of a heart. And he is already like, what's she like? Okay. Okay. I'm okay with this though. Hey there. I was just daydreaming about some carpentry products. Are you doing okay at your place? How's woodworking in your cottage holding up? Oh, I thought she was asking if I was doing woodworking, because then I was like, wait, but I'm not. You're probably growing a lot of interesting plants on your farm. Um, just some parsnips and a whole bunch of, like, 
grass. Maybe I'll stop by your place someday and check it out. I know you will. It's three. Does he leave on a rainy day? Are you leaving? Like, I want to talk to you. No, you're going to crash. Yes, you're leaving. I am such a fan. Sebastian, I'm such a fan of yours. And now that I know that you're asking about me, I'm nosy. What am I going to do today? Probably nothing. That's it. You're not going to tell me more stuff. I have cookies. Will you accept the cookies? No, don't be mad. Here, I'm going to follow you with cookies. I feel like I'm pushing my luck already and I shouldn't. Here, cookies. Thanks, I like this. You should, because I don't willingly give out those cookies that I find in Evelyn's trash can. I usually hoard them for myself. But that's fine. They were trash cookies anyway, so it's not a big deal. But we got new dialogue, which was interesting. And kind of cute. I found that dialogue cute and... <laughs> Am I gonna learn something absolutely awful about myself playing this mod? Is that what's gonna happen? And throw some stuff in here. Um, I'm gonna keep that just for food. I was gonna fish today and that didn't happen. I was too busy focusing on other things. Oops. It's fine. Totally fine. Let's go. We could go to the saloon and just talk to everyone tonight. Um, that might be worth doing. Still nothing on the help wanted board. There's Pam. We could talk to Alex because we couldn't talk to him earlier. Oh, hello, Sebastian. This is not good weather for sports. I mean, you could find something. Maybe. Um, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to tell this boy. I don't know things about sports. As long as it's not thundering and lightning, can't you still play football? Isn't that a possibility? Oh, well, I can always lift weights inside. You were already today, but okay. Yes, I'm going in the saloon, Sebastian. Stop following me in there. I'm here to talk to my best friend, Pam. Hey, kid. You're too young to be moping about in a place like this. <laughs> Pam, I'm not moping. I swear. That's weird. How come I can just keep saying that to her? Good evening. Can I get you anything? Okay, he just keeps repeating that. I can't even talk to Emily. Oh, I talked to her already. That's why. Leah. This morning I accidentally stepped on a bug. Oh. I'm sorry. I don't know how to take that. I don't know, like, what to do to help. Is... Actually, I think I gave Sam a gift already, didn't I? I know I can buy Sam gifts. Jojo Colts? No, I can give him one. Look at that. We'll do that. Go gift Sam some teeth rotting soda. Well, that's Shane. I Shane likes these too, doesn't he? Let's see what Shane says. This weather makes me thirsty. I forgot he said that when it rains. Oh, you poor thing. Hi, Luna. Uh, read anything interesting in the library lately? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> well, um, I'll see you around then. I guess I just don't ever talk to Harvey that I just don't know what his stuff is. We're gonna buy two. I have I have enough Georgia Colas for everyone. Oops, I thought he liked them. Oh well, I don't... We're not here for Shane. Ahoy there, it's nice to see young folk moving around the valley. It's very, not very common these days. I need a little warm me up to be ready for another cold night on the ocean. Oh, I'm not buying you beer. I'm too broke for that, my good sir. Very broke for that. 
Now, can I get into Sam's house to give him a gift before seven? I bet you I can't. Oh my gosh, I did it right in time and he's in his room. I want to look for bugs, but mom gets mad when I get not when I'm all dirty. It's a tough choice. You're Oh, Vincent. What did you say? It's 710 already? My goodness. I still have tons of work to do. Well, you could make Sam help you. Can I? I can't even walk in the open door to just, like, give Vincent a gift. I see how it is, you guys. Just rifle through the trash cans before I be on my way. Again, was gonna spend this rainy day fishing, and I was too busy talking to everyone in town to see what they say. And I'm glad I did. Because, like, it was kind of a, a moment. Like, we got new dialogue, so I'm cool with that. I will need to take some time to fish, though, for sure. So. I don't know if what fish are considered on the hilltop farm. I can try it and see. Because I feel like they might be... Uh, oh my gosh, I'm stuck. And I have nothing to help me. That's a fishing pole. Okay, we might not be going to talk to anyone tomorrow. It will be fixing this freaking farm. That's what it's going to be. <laughs> That's the focus. Let's see what we catch. It might just be trash, but it might be river fish. I can't remember. This isn't... Stardew fishing. I swear. So much clicking. Oh no, it is river fish, so it's kind of worth it. I'll just fish until my energy it goes down or I run out of time. It's fine. Look at that. Perfect. I'm like, I... I'm just gonna wait till a fish bites before I try and even attempt to grab my water bottle. Oh, jeez. What, what is living in the river by my house? Okay. Let's see that. Water break. I forgot I named this place Old Farm Farm. You know, choices were made. And that's one choice I'm actually kind of proud of. I'm okay with it. I want to know what fish that was just now that I tried to catch. Kind of weird. Oh well. Oh, fishing. So, what is it? Uh, day four. Day four, we'll do farm cleanup. We won't really leave probably the farm at all because it'll just be a Thursday. I know it's worth talking to everyone, but I'm going to get a lot of the same dialogue since it's the beginning of the season. So I'm not too, too worried. I don't really have any good gifts either. So best not to anger anybody with the wrong gift which could be bad so oh my gosh fishing there we go and then this will also if i can spend some time on the farm and fishing and collecting stuff i can uh Buy the stuff for the George Mart. We're just doing the George Mart route. My choice has been I got distracted. My bad. Let's see. I'm looking to see what the Yeah, okay. We're doing George Mart route. I have decided. I might actually keep that brain because someone's gonna want 
I think someone asked for that season. If I'm correct. So worth keeping. I want to sell the other ones, but I'm also like, I could keep them for food. Uh, we can catch a few more. See, I had to worry. I'm like, no, I don't. I have till 2 a.m. As long as I can get everything sold, we're fine. With that, we even leveled. Uh, that is not the way of water. Oh my gosh, I'm going in the wrong spot. Thank you. Yes. Glasses. I need to figure out how to make the recycler as well. Yes, I know it's 1 a.m. You're fine. I know. I don't remember what the glasses give me in the recycler. But I feel like it's something that I want to keep. It, it's better than the newspaper or the trash, if I'm correct. So. Mm -hmm. Okay, one more. I just want one more fish. That's it. Not a fish, a CD, but I'm gonna keep that as well. Running back to my house. It's nice that I can fish all this up at- oh, crud. Okay, well, I'm not doing that. She needs to get some sleep. We'll sell it to Willie. Wow, was that just from Clay? Okay. Note to self. Sell Clay. Got it. Okay, day four. Uh, living off of land. Check for spring onions. We need to go do spring onions. That's actually a big one. Oracle is not happy with me. Clear and sunny. Okay. So we're going to clean up the farm. We have another thing of mail. Who sent me mail? Robin here. I know it's a lot of stone. I know there's a lot of stones scattered around your farm. If you have a surplus, you might consider having me build a well for you. Wells can be placed all over your farm and serve as a convenient place to refill your watering can. Just swing by my shop with 75 stone and a thousand gold when you're ready for it. Hilltop Farm is going to require a well for sure. Because there's not any... Like, there's water sources, but not great water sources. Um, I was going to sell. I'm keeping you. I'm selling you. I'm selling the newspaper. I know the newspaper doesn't give me anything, but I don't want it on my person. Put away the stuff that we're keeping for who knows why. I should have grabbed all my other stuff because I have to get through this jungle of a farm. Okay. Are you kidding me? I just want to go water these freaking parsnips. That's it. That's the only reason. I have one more day. We'll have some parsnips and then I can kind of decide what I want to grow. Um, I know someone asked for a cauliflower, so I should probably do that. I'll have enough wild seeds, though. I might not even buy seeds from Peter. That could be a thing. Screw Peter and his seeds. Oh, nope. I want that. Okay. Uh, move the whole. I really probably don't need the fishing pole right now. I'll put the fishing pole away. There we go. Okay, let's do some cleanup. Because this is really starting to get to me. And then we also need to... Um... I do need to figure... I need to remember what Caroline likes for gifts. Um, because her friendship is going to be very important. Oh, that's a stump. Um, for money making. So we will need to do that. 
I also need the wood so I can get the... Uh, what's it called? The bridge. The bridge, that's what it is. I would like to clear that up so I can forge over there as well. Because that will make me some monies. I kind of know what I need to do. If I could see better, it'd be great. There's freaking trees in my way. They're just so pretty. I don't want to get rid of them all yet. Um, but I do, I kind of know what I need to actually get done to be uh, productive for doing Jojo Mart. And just making money but I can sell like everything for once which I love the only downside is I kind of want to just open the community center to go in and see it because I have the Judimo mod on so we might have to do that just once and go see the Junimos and then that'd be that break that break that Um, let's break down some of these trees as well. Wow, I turned her all the way around. Are you kidding me? Do, 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 do. I'm gonna get rid of a lot of these trees because I will have to use this space for something. I lost all that. Are you kidding? No, I didn't. Ah ha ha. Thought you could break the trees away from me. I don't know what I was thinking about saying. Leveling up. I do need to level up too so I can upgrade the house for a kitchen. What is the other thing I need to do? There's much to do. But we can do it. Oh, I'm gonna feel exhausted, aren't I? Need that. Oh, I don't have a lot of food. Crud. I've done like nothing. No. Ugh. Wow, I've cleared out that. That's it. And I've watered some plants. Great. I don't even have enough of anything. Well, that sucks. Okay, um... It is 12. We could go to... We can go forage around and I can eat the things I find. Oh, that's an option, right? We'll forage. Oh, spring onions. That's where we need to go. We'll go the long way. We'll go the long way. It's fine. It's fine. Every time that loads in, I think it's going to open the community center, but it doesn't. It just takes a while to load because I have so many mods. This one can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes we even put a coin in the jukebox. Oh my gosh, you're partying. I like to visit once a week or so to catch up on things anyways. Okay. Ooh, a quest. What do you want from me? Make Pam happy. Green algae. I'll accept it, but I'm concerned. Uh, what do you have to say? Nutrition is important, so make sure and eat well and try and increase your vegetable intake. Home-cooked meals are best. Can you cook? I mean, if I try... Oh, I'm not spending all my money on that. I did want to talk to Maru. That's actually what I wanted to do. No, I don't have an appointment. Harvey. Oh. Oh, hi. I guess Abigail has an appointment. I'm nosy. Can I, like, see their conversation? What's up? How much longer do you need, Doc? I'm hungry. 
Interesting. I plan on spending a lot of time with my telescope this summer. Okay, that's a normal conversation. Oh, I thought she was gonna go in there too. I'll leave them to, to whatever's happening. She's at a doctor's appointment. I shouldn't be nosy. It could be a fair price for produce. Mm -hmm. Sure you will. How much do you want for this 2000? Look, it's Elliot. Hello, Luna. Are you well? Um, I mean, can you tell I'm absolutely like on the verge of exhaustion? Is that what you're trying to get at? I'm a flower. I'm not a huge fan of this. You people don't like my gifts. I'm just trying to be nice. When your parents teach you to accept a gift, even if you don't like it, you're supposed to be polite. Evelyn, everyone's being mean to me. <laughs> I'll be baking cookies today. I like to make flower shapes in the spring. Maybe I'll tell you the recipe of these someday. I need to become her friend because I forget she gives you the best baking recipes. Uh, let's see if there's anything to forage out here before I go into the woods. Aha! The shells didn't leave. Like clams, shells, you know. Pretty much the same thing. This. Yeah, it probably wasn't the best thing for me to do, but I found an anchor. Let's go turn it in. Okay. Gunther, I come bringing you an anchor. What can you give me in return? Anything? I'm pretty sure it's Willie's and he lost it. Let's put the anchor over there. Nothing? I don't get anything for bringing you a whole anchor? My thing is I just put an anchor in my pocket and walked away. That's questionable. No one has anything good in their- well, it's not a lucky day, is it? Oh look, it's Sam. What does Sam have to say? The clouds look great this time of year, don't they? I want to talk to him. Like scoops of vanilla ice cream floating on blue raspberry sauce. Or maybe I'm just hungry. Oh my gosh. I, I can't with him sometimes. I think that is normal dialogue for him, though, if I'm correct. Do you get rid of the trash cans? Nothing good. If I'm correct, that's their, that's his normal dialogue. It doesn't seem out of the ordinary for him to say something like that to me. What's up? I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. And you actually listen to Marnie, unlike your friend Vincent, who doesn't listen at all. I need something. I might be getting some different kinds of animals in the future. Although, I'll need to make sure there's a market for them, so you'll have to prove your skill with your skills with animals first. Just keep treating your animals with respect and good things will happen. Okay. I don't have animals, but I'll be nice. You have lovely cows. Your cows are lovely. Radishes! Oh. I'm here for the radishes. Look at all these onions and harvestables. I must collect them all. It is important. So I don't starve to death. That would be terrible if I did. Let's see. Oh, there's two more over here. I mean, I could eat that. It might be worth doing. I can still forage around here, though. Let's see what I can, uh... find. Okay, nothing. Finding absolutely nothing to forage. Oh, I'll take that. A 
just kind of do a short lap. Okay, not bad. Oh, crud. Um, oh, no, I do have my sign. I can't get up that way, though. Stupid rocks. That's what I need to work on is uh definitely clearing out and collecting uh everything so I can upgrade them weapons. There's not gonna really be anyone at the saloon right now. So we're just gonna sell some stuff. I'm gonna keep those for food for the time being. And we'll let her sleep so she's not absolutely exhausted. Hopefully we made some money. Okay, I can make field snacks, which is great. Necessary right now. It's the fish from the other day. Not bad. Not bad at all. I just have to make so much money. Once the parsnips are grown, that will help. Clear and sunny day. Fortune teller. And happy spirits. Ooh, and the traveling merchants in town with all the money I don't have. Hi, Marnie. You see this cat here? Yeah, I do. It's a cat. Uh, I found it sitting outside the entrance of your farm. I think it's a stray. Poor little thing. I think it likes this place. Don't you think this farm could use a good cat? Yes. And I know exactly what I'm going to name the cat. It's Grandpa. That's Grandpa. He's visited before year three. Well, little Grandpa, you'll be a good kitty now, okay? Again, choices were made and I'm okay with them. Okay. To our valued Jojamart customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal. Insert legal jargon here. Responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. Sure it is. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris. Georgia customer satisfaction representative. What fun. I'm about to own you, sir. Like, in, in a little, well, kind of a literal term. Maybe not really. We'll just pretend like I will. Um, okay. So now we have foraging head. Not that one. Where is it? Oh, I don't get anything for that, do I? No, I do. I thought I didn't, and I was going to be sad. Um, I don't think I have the stuff to start a furnace, though, do I? No, I don't think so. Maybe I do. Can I make a furnace? Oh, it's stone. Duh. It's not that. No, I can make a furnace. Ha ha ha. Let's put some stuff away. I'll keep those out for now. Um, I can sell these now. That works. Um, I know where I'm putting these. Over here. Please tell me I can cross the road. Yes, I can never- I still can't figure out or remember what bridges I can and cannot take right now. Okay, we have another one to- that for now these things can stay here. Yeah. But then I can it'll all kind of be in one spot. At least for the time being. I need to fill in those holes that I dug apparently. As they have not filled themselves in. And then what else do we need to do? I guess we need to go to the mine. See what's happening over there. Uh, Pam wanted me to fish for her, but that's just, that's not going to happen right now. Okay, this is all cleaned up. So we'll grab our food. 
and we'll go to the mine. Oh my gosh, there. Rage. And we'll cook that. There we go. Oh, no, it's level one in Crafted Scarecrow. I can do that too, can't I? I guess I can. I just haven't yet. I don't have anything or any reason to. I have nothing growing right now. This is all about money making. I'll get to farming, but I want to go to... Uh, I know where I'm going. That's simply what I'm saying, is I know where I'm going. That's it. We'll sell those. Um... Sell those. Take the good one with us. I'm sure I'll find more food along the way. I don't need that and I don't have a weapon yet. Right? Yeah. I had to think. Let's kind of move some stuff real fast. And then we are going to the mines. Why is this yelling at me? Yes, to go make a scarecrow. I'm not doing that right now. I have other things to attend to. To attend to. I'm making up words now, too. Okay, Linus is there. I don't think this is the day that Sebastian goes out and about. He probably actually won't leave the house again until 2, and I don't have time for that. And Mars and her room. You've met my son Sebastian, right? He lives downstairs. He's a little shy, but I'm sure he'll warm up to you if you're nice to him. That's normal dialogue. I'm trying to remember what is and isn't normal dialogue. Robin has a hot temper. It's better to stay on her good side. Don't tell her I said that. Maru, are you coming out? Yes. Do you have more to tell me about Sebastian? Hey, sorry if I seem cranky. I'm a little sore from work yesterday. I had to sort patient records for four hours straight. That's sad. You also had to deal with Abigail, and I'm pretty sure Abigail would fight Harvey if she had to get a shot. Like, I feel like she would be the one to, like, throw hands with Harvey. <laughs> okay, and then, because you are the sweetest of soul. It's a great gift. What do you have to say to me? Please don't destroy my tent. It's happened before. It, yeah, because Sebastian throws rocks at the mountain. I know that much. <laughs> okay. Finally, we're in the mines. Mm. Oh, he looks so tough and gruff. I love it. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Yeah, someone leaves boots in there for me too. Here, take this. You might need it. Just casually give someone a sword and say good luck. He received a rusty sword. Name is Marlin, by the way. I run the Adventurer's Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself, and I'll, I might think about making you a member. Okay. Sure. Let's put... I was like, where'd the sword go? There we go. Okay. Actually, I want the sword first. Force of habit. I have some energy. It's a lucky day. Come on, let me find what I'm looking for. Something better from these rocks. Okay, copper's good. I need copper. Boot upgrade. Yes. Let's this. Don't do that. Uh, I don't know how 
much. I just, I don't mind the mines, but I don't enjoy it all the time. Especially with the not good weapon. The sooner I can get a better weapon, the best. Because last thing I want to do is to die and be in the mine and lose everything. I'm going to look around somewhere else. Oh, there's already one. Perfect. Okay, I want that because that is a giftable gift. God, I know these slimes are worth fighting if I can hit them. Just eat some snacks in here. Good thing I brought all this food with me. <laughs> Thank goodness. Um, oh my gosh. And some aggressive food eating. <laughs> that way, that way, that way, that way, that way. Go. I did it. Perfect. Let's see. I'm loving the ore I'm finding, though. Ooh. Very nice. I will take that. Nice gifts. Oh my gosh. Okay. Get rid of that. Just casually throw that away. I can't pick that up either, can I? Uh, I'll make a choice in a second. Let's do that and pick that up. I need some gifts for my people. Since I basically am going to be gifting- oh my gosh, there's so many slimes. I don't have the weapons for this. There's one. Come here, other slime. And green slimes aren't even like that bad. Don't so just mad at me. I'm trying to put you out of your misery. Okay. Go that way. Oh, okay, that works. I'll be back. Or... Ooh, and I leveled up my mine even better. Mining, right? Yeah. I'm actually a decent level of mining. I think I'm already two? Yeah. Ugh. I just don't like combat at low levels. It's not fun. Level four, we'll get to level five. Let's see what's down here. More slime. Oops. Um, more slime. Yeah, I'm complaining about slime, but I know the minute I get any farther, I'm gonna complain about everything else that I have to fight. And they're all so much worse. Like the bugs at the next level, those things are awful. Until you have a decent weapon. Not those bugs, the the obnoxious ones. Actually, let's I'm just take an onion. There's two, and I don't trust myself to not die. And I have plenty of onions. Okay. We might go from the bush. They're so bad. We want to pick up a few things. There's some things in there. No, no, you don't see me. You didn't see me at all. I mostly want to pick up stuff, but I think I'm going to have her 
just I just want to double check, see if there's anything else in here. There's some chests. I want her to go give, give some gifts at the same time. She can't. No, he's been giving all his gifts. Okay, never mind. We're just gonna keep doing stuff here. My inventory's full, but I mean, I guess we could go to the saloon and talk to people. We'll do it the next day. We still have enough time to actually get some stuff done and pick up some some things. So let's. Oh gosh, <laughs> why that scared me? Because they hurt. Uh, there we go. Usually those things... Whatever. It's fine. I'm here for the ore. What else am I here for? I have to remember. That's a torch that I just broke. Not ideal. See if there's a ladder over here. Maybe, probably not. I bet you have to destroy something in the process to get it. Oh, look at you and your little star on your head. Lots of clicking. You drop shoes. Um, here, let's do this. Eat the parsnip. And then, did I pick up the shoes? Yes, some sneakers. Those, they are red. That's fine. Um, wow, I just, I'm not even gonna go the long way around. Forget it. I didn't want to. more I want to sleep as far as I can right now. Actually, probably not in it with those. Okay. No. Oh, I'm running out of energy. I really just need one more. Oh, God, it's those things. Not in an ideal spot. Uh oh. I'm just gonna stand here and hit it. There we go. I have to make better choices. This is gonna be the one where I'm not gonna find the ladder. How much you want a bet? Uh, never mind, I found it. Those are the better shoes. Just casually switch out our shoes real fast. Level zero, we can leave. Okay. Let's get back to what is this? Can I pick it up? No, I can't. It was just something I could forge. Interesting. I don't know how I missed that earlier. Okay. Um, we're gonna get back and we're gonna sell all this stuff. Well, most of it. I want to keep some of it for gifts. I actually probably should have gone over to what's his face. Uh oh my gosh, stop telling me to make a scarecrow. I'll make one in a minute. Level 40 in the mines. Okay. Oh, I can do that. The little tree was making me mad. Um, okay. Keeping that, which I need to take one to Gunther. That we can take to Gunther. Actually, all that we can take to Gunther. But I want to keep them too, so I don't know what we're going to do. It just kind of depends. Wow, I have 
nothing to sell after that, actually. Great. Great. Oh, we gotta give give Grandpa some love. <laughs> okay. Oh, well now I can make a watering can. Not a watering can. I can make a scarecrow now. And mining level two. I need to go buy some seeds, I guess. Which, eh. I don't even know. I guess I'll go to the Joji Mart and buy seeds. Let's see. It's gonna rain tomorrow. Even better. And spirits are in good humor. This could be another mining day. Ooh, I have a letter. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventure spirit. That much I'll tell you. If you can slay ten slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventures guild. Be careful. Oh, okay. Here, Grandpa. <laughs> I love that I named you Grandpa. Um, let's grab some stuff that I wanted to take to Gunther, I guess. Because if I turn in enough stuff, Gunther will give me seeds. If I'm correct. Uh, so we'll do that. I've just realized I want to take... Where's my hoe? There's my hoe. In case we find anything along the way. Like this one that's bothering me. Clay. Clay is good. Clay is money. I've never been so excited to pick up just clumps of dirt. <gasps> uh, it's raining tomorrow. Good spirits. This all should actually be clay too. Even better. That's a chicken statue. And I need it. I'll come back for you, chicken statue. Don't worry. I can't even pick that up because my choice is buy spring onions. You go live on the ground now. Wait. Actually, no, I don't have enough. I need to put a chest down there. That's what I have to do. I took my brain a minute to comprehend what I was actually planning. Okay. So we're gonna go turn in this stuff. I can give him the- yeah, and I can give him the chicken statue. Go forage around at the beach, pick up a bunch of stuff. We'll do this before I go buy seeds, though. Okay. I didn't think I'd unlock this already. Oh, hi there. I feel like it always takes me a while. What an eyesore. This is the Pelican Town Community Center. Or what's left of it anyways. Okay. Well, sir, it's gonna be an eyesore soon because I'm not taking this route. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Come on, Lewis. Now just look at it. It's shameful. These days, these young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. Well, but listen to me. I sound like an old fool. Maybe they just don't want to hang out in the community center. Joji Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. No. Oh. If anyone else buys Jojico membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. That will be me soon. That's the plan. <sighs> Here, let's go inside. I do wanna, you know, see our adorable Junimos, which I don't think anything, I don't think the mod works until after I do all this. Uh, what is this? I guess Vincent and ja uh, Jazz have been in here playing. Yeah, they usually are. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. Hello. What? Just casually waving to... Not Lewis. 
And maybe if I do it enough, Lewis will think he's the one that's gone crazy. What's the matter? Are you ill? Yes. <laughs> you saw something. Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. Love it. No, it's just that little Junimo over there, you know, dancing, headbanging, living their best life. You're worrying me, Luna. I worry myself. Look, I think I'm gonna head home. I need some lunch. Don't offer me a sandwich or anything. I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can catch that rat if you have some extra time. I love that it's also like 8 a.m. He's like, I need lunch. I'll have to come back and explore the building further. So I should be able to... Oh, it didn't even send me all the way back. I'll just take this. That. Can't read it. It's fine. At least do that. That way we can meet our dear sweet mes... mes Rasmodius. Um, so we can do that. No one's really out and about yet. So I don't have to worry about chatting with anyone just yet. Which is fine with me. Oh, no, there are people out and about. Okay, what do you have to say? My arms are really sore, but that's a sign of progress from a guy like me. I must have done a thousand push-ups yesterday. Can you count that high? That's my question. Can I do anything for you? Take care. Oh, okay. I'll just leave then. I'll just... I'm just gonna go over here. Okay. Sir, I brought you things. I brought you a chicken statue. That is worth its weight in gold. It goes right in the front. Um, that one. That one. Oh, I should have moved that. Oh, well. Uh, purple. Brown. That's all I can turn in. What are you gonna give me? Collect the rewards. Yes, cauliflower seeds. Nah. <laughs> now I don't really have to buy seeds. I can. That's a seed. I have requested too much. That's fine. Um, I think until I get the Jojimont membership, it's cheaper to um, buy from him currently. If I'm correct, everything is cheaper here right now. Yeah, they're only 25. I think they're 50 at Pierre's. Maybe not 50. But they're close. Okay. Um. Let's see. What do I want to get? I guess the cheapest thing is parsnips. Let's get like... 25? We'll get 30. We'll get 30 of them. I usually- I don't mind beans, but beans make me mad, so. <laughs> I don't want to deal with that. Oh my gosh, it's our boy Sebastian. We need to go say hi to him. Sebastian, it's been like a day that we haven't talked to you. What? I didn't hear you. I'm busy thinking about something. Yeah, because I snuck up on you. What are you thinking about? We want... I thought we were friends. I'm leaving. Goodbye. We talked to Penny. She'll enjoy my company, unlike you. This is such a small town. You can't avoid meeting everyone. Are you telling me you don't want to be friends? I wonder what it's like to live in this city. Penny, I would worry that you would get lost. Dad's coming back soon. I hope he brings me some toys. Sam, have a conversation with your brother about this. I just remembered that I was meaning to do something, but I forgot. 
when I'm romancing Sebastian, but I am so similar to Sam, it's not even funny. This happens to me all the time. I can believe it because it happens to me all the time too. You smell like grass. Is that a compliment? Because I'm... Does that mean, like, Marnie smells like hay? Hey, look, it's Haley. I'm feeling an urge to go shopping. Ugh, I wish there was a mall here. Where would we put it in this town? We'll talk soon. I don't think I've... I haven't been able to really make... Like, get the hearts up. Linus is the only one with a heart. Of course, it's only been, like, one week. I'm, I'm trying to rush through this, and I shouldn't. I should enjoy the pace that everything is going. Because the minute everything kicks off, it's going to kick off, and I'm going to be concerned. Okay. We picked up what was over here. Oh, look, it's Elliot. Let's talk to Elliot. We gotta make sure we keep our, our people chatted up. You probably wouldn't like it inside my cabin. It's dark and full of spiders. You're correct. I don't like spiders. So you can keep them in there. Is he sure there's spiders and not just... They aren't just like crabs or something in there? He's having a conversation. Hmm? Hmm? Really? I was walking there. Guys got all up in my way. Was that Shane? Oh, it was. Hello, Shane. Why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. Jeez. Cry me a river. Willie, these these people. If a local fishing scene got a bit more lively, I might expand the shop stock. I wish. We need more people like Willie in town. That's what I'm requesting. I would like all the fishing people to please come to Stardew Valley and replace those who are living here. Please and thank you. Okay, well there was one, literally one spring onion that was useless. is kind of a bust. I know the next day, it's raining the next day, but that's going to be the day that Rosmodius is like, come to my wizard's tower. I'm going to make you drink some weird po poison of the forest and we'll see where things go from there. And I'm not okay with that right now. So I'm trying to figure out what to do to prioritize my time. I need to plant these things. Let's just do that. I guess I can clean up a little bit too. I don't have any of my stuff to do that though. <clears throat> That's fine. We will put everything away, grab everything. It's a Saturday. I mean, I could ultimately have a well built, but do I want to do that yet is the question. Oops, so that. Then, let's clean up all this a little bit. That sounds kind of weird. I don't want, like, too much space, if that makes sense. I don't want to be wasting all my energy uh, watering plants. So we'll do it in batches. I think that makes the most sense. Um, we'll put those in there. And then we'll grab everything else and that. And we'll water all of it. That way, nothing dies. Uh, and then I won't... Oops. There we go. Grandpa needs his water. <laughs> Grandpa needs water. 
And I'm out of water. Of course. I mean, not that it's a long walk, but it definitely takes a, a smidgen more time than I would prefer. I don't know where I'd put the well. It would be so in the way right there. I'll probably make this something different, honestly. Okay. I did that. I can put the watering can away because I don't need it um, now for a couple days. I forget what the scarecrow needs. Look at that. I made it. And he takes up plenty of space, so... Let's put you over here, right there. Beautiful. Then put this stuff away. We will slowly keep clearing our way over to our um the other place. The other place where the rocks are. I need to cut down some trees so I can make a chest for over there, too. Break these as well. Anything to make it look even just a little bit better is nice. There's so much stuff I haven't picked up because my bags have just been full. That's a hoe. Oops. My bad. I'm trying to think. I have a feeling I need to... Mm, I think it's the pick I'm going to have to upgrade first. Or that's going to be more worth upgrading right away. Um, mostly for the mines. I think that's the way I'm going to have to go. That. Give me that. Get rid of all the grass. Then I can save the the seeds for when I don't want to buy any. Okay. Um. Uh, oops. That. It's already looking a good bit better. We are gonna get rid of a couple trees though. Well, if I can. I'm kinda on the verge of passing out. Not really. I could probably get rid of it one tree. Come on. There we go. Can I afford to is there anything? There's a spring onion just living up here. Let's real fast. Okay, can I make a chest? No, I need more wood. Crud. Let's hope I can do this. I, I still probably... I should have enough after I cut down this tree. Open. Okay. I have 60. Perfect. Now I can make a chest for up here. And I can put this. There we go. And then we'll put our chest there. And kind of keep everything. Well, I probably shouldn't have done that. Then I can do that. And not even worth it. I'll just stand here and let these kind of cook away. While I'm here. There we go. And then I can kind of keep the extra stuff put to the side. What do I need for a second furnace? I would have had enough, so we're gonna actually put that stone in there. And I feel like I need to just keep doing it. 
better to have the bars because then I can upgrade sooner. It's three. I have four, five. How many do I need to upgrade? Is it five or six? I can't remember. We will, we'll see. Um, oh, I can make one more. Put five whole nine. I'll take two over to that side. Actually, I'm not. I'll split it and then I can always make a, uh, what is it? A charcoal furnace or creator or whatever and keep it over there to make it. I didn't. I need one more. Okay, so that can go there. Wait for this one. And then... Move along, and she can go to sleep. Yes, yes, I know you're tired. Let me pick up this one spring onion. Oh, I'm going to pick up a bunch of stuff on the way in. Can I make torches real fast? There we go. Uh. Okay, torch. There. And then we will also put a torch here. And we'll put a torch there. There. There, now it's not completely dark. Um, wow, I have enough. That. I don't think I have enough to fully upgrade. I, what, it's 2,000 to upgrade, maybe? I don't remember. Okay. Sleepy time. Let's see. Okay, spring onions don't make squat. Got it. Spring onions are just good for the food. Um, okay, it's raining. Grandpa got attention. Weather reports. Clear day tomorrow. Fortune teller is telling me or they're not happy. And a recipe for stir fry. It's a perfect way to get something healthy, some healthy greens on your plate. Saute the greens in a little sesame oil. Make sure to add plenty of fresh ginger and garlic. Breathe deeply. That's it. You learned how to make stir fry. What a recipe. I feel like she's very vague on her recipes, but... Okay. My sources tell me that you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. M. Rasmodius Wizard. I do like this mod for, like, the the really cute, like, overlay, but it does make reading stuff kind of hard sometimes. And Rasmodius' special paper didn't help. Okay, um... From the look of it, we're not going to the mine. It's Lewis's birthday. Um, you know what I haven't been checking? The billboard. No one has anything. What I do want to do is... I'm going to take six. We're going to take some stuff with us. Um... We're going to take that. We're going to put... The sword away. Yeah, the sword away. We'll take everything else for now. Um... I don't think if you go see Rasmodius, it messes up the day, but I might wait till the last minute of the day to go see him and kind of do everything else real fast. Um, just because I don't want to take that risk. It's still early. Let's take through the trash cans while no one's awake and it's raining. I tried to hit that one with 
a pick. Broken glasses. Um, we'll run down here and do some exploration. Clay. I know there's a way to farm clay, but I don't know how to do it. Also, just like, I don't want to take the time to do that. I'd have to look up how to do it, though. You have to, like, move a certain direction, take a certain amount of steps, and dig up certain spots. And I'm sure I would find a way to mess it up. Uh, I thought I had something for you, but I guess I don't because I don't know why I came in here. I guess I just wanted to look at your beautiful face, Gunther. Ugh. You know, Clint, I would like to be able to come here at a decent time. But because that can't happen, I now have to wait. Okay, 9 a.m. Can I upgrade? No, it's 2,000. Wait, is it still... It only requires five. Okay, but it is... I need another 1,000 gold. Great. I've organized that. I can, I can give some gifts. I guess that's worth doing. Um... I still don't know everyone's routine when it's raining. I have a Jojo Cola for Sam. We can give Abigail an Amethyst. Someone's bound to like a Topaz. Someone's gonna be in their rooms and I'm not good enough. Haley's still sleeping, apparently. I don't blame her. I would be too. So that makes me think Sam is still sleeping. Let's talk to them. Hi there, miss. I'm taking the day off. If I don't spend any time outside, I'll go crazy. Okay, so Jody's gonna take a nice walk in the rain. Plus, I don't want my legs to turn soft. Okay. Oh, is this like one of those days where Sam just peers into his dresser for a multitude of reasons that we don't know? Sam... I'm not good enough friends with anyone. Jeez. Okay. Well, that didn't work. I should be able to get into Pierre's shop. Let's do that. Pierre, I'm not here to give you a gift. I'm just here to talk to you. Most people stay indoors on days like this. It's not good for business. Terrible. Abigail's in her room. Come on, Abigail. Please leave. Yes. Let's I want to talk to her first. And see what she says. The valley looks more interesting in the rain, don't you think? Does it? I seriously love this. You're the best. Awesome. That puts me at almost a full heart with Abigail. Oh, I keep forgetting to gift you things, my dear. I'm sorry. The garden's happy today, and our water bill will be lower this month. Oh, I wish I remember what button this was. Oh well. Um. Do you want a shiny rock? I don't. I know she likes like produce and stuff. So I don't want to risk giving her something and just have her not be happy. So, what is her... I want to see... Yeah. So, I mean, if you talk to people, like, every day, you earn friendship with them. Though... Not always the greatest. Oh, hello. If you're lucky, you might see a frog in this weather. Oh, is this the frog talk day? Okay. Be that, be that way, bud. Howdy, kids. Stand dry. 
No, we're in the rain talking, Pam. I don't know what you expect. Okay, um... Oh yeah, I was gonna go try and give Sam... A gift. If Sam has left his house, but I don't think Sam is gonna leave his house. Nope, Sam is playing guitar. And I'm not waiting around for that. Nope, not happening. So we will go to our dear Asmodeus. Uh, we'll also pop in and see what the uh, the traveling merchant has today. Oh, it was Lewis's birthday, and did I get him anything? No. Not a thing. A tulip. I mean, a tulip could be. Wow, that's just ridiculous. Summer Spangle, that's expensive for Summer Spangle. That's really cute, and I refuse to spend all my money on it. None of that. Don't try to tempt me with your wares. Not when they're that overpriced. And of course, my inventory's full. Of course. Okay, so Resmodius. Let's have our moment. Ah, come in. Oh my gosh, he's like all beardy in this with these pictures. Lovely. I am Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths, mediary between physical and ethereal, master of the seven elements, Keep, keeper of the sacred. Ch you get the point. <laughs> I love that he's even like, I have too many titles, just. I'm a wizard. And you, the one whose arrival I have been long foreseen. I didn't read that right, I'm sorry. Here, I'd like to show you something. Uh, behold. Looks like a good magic trick. They squeak. You've seen one before, haven't you? They call themselves the Junos. Mysterious spirits. These ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Maybe it's your beard. Could be. I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Yeah, that thing. You found a golden scroll written in an unknown language. Most interesting. Yeah, pretty much. Stay here, I'm going to see for myself. I will return shortly. Teleport. You think I'd be used to all this stuff since I'm the one who's basically an elf in this. <laughs> I found the note. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Uh, don't don't give me this potion. I'm not in the mood for it. Hmm. One with the forest. What do they mean? Who knows anymore? Sniff, 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 sniff. There we go. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. Come here, face. <laughs> oh no. I don't want to now. No. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss scrub, caramel top toadstool. Can you smell it? Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. Prefer if it didn't. <laughs> Can we not? Give me 37 energy though. 
And it made me sick to my stomach. <laughs> Great. Oh, I can't click through it. Okay. Oh, dancing trees, dancing leaves. She's uh, definitely having a moment, that's for sure. Okay, not that I don't love the dancing trees, but... Come on. You've gained the power of the forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. I've done it. I'm a wizard. Yeah, it didn't mess up my day. Perfect. Um, what I am going to do, though, is I guess I'll just send her... Wow, it's not a good day, though. Never mind. I was like, oh, we'll send her to the mines. Uh, no, I will not go to the mines, actually. I need to make some money. That's what I need to do. So I guess I'm going to just stick to cleaning stuff up around the farm. I think that's the best plan of action. Oops. Um, and she can fish, actually. We can do that, too. We'll clean up a little bit, and then we'll let her... Uh, she can fish on the farm. Be perfect. Let's pick up a little bit of this stuff. There we go. Mostly we just that spot. It's fine. Um... That I'll clean up a little bit later. Okay. Oops, very good stuff. Nope, it's all on that. There. Okay. And we're just gonna let her fish the rest of the day, pretty much. Um, organize that. That way, maybe I can spend some money on gifts for people in the valley compared to just um, farming up stuff since I'm not really doing that. So. But fish will make money if I catch anything. That's, that's the big thing. I caught Sam a gift. Okay. Oh, it's an unlucky day. I'm not going to catch anything good. That's the problem there. I will catch absolutely nothing with a while. As I get the chest, I'm okay with the chest. Unless it's full of rocks. What I get? Oh, well, it's full of coal and geo. That's not the worst. I've had worse. Green algae. Pam wanted that a few days ago. If I get lucky, someone else will too. If I get lucky. Might not happen. More trash. Absolutely love it. Ooh, there's another chest. I'm okay with the chests. As long as I can catch the fish. Because I really don't want to spend the money on the beginner rod at this point. Some more geo, some more coal. Coal's always good to have. The mouse keeps doing its own thing. Oh, lovely. Again, I love when Sardi Valley just is like, here's a random sound. Like, I didn't ask for that. Depending on what we catch next, I might throw some stuff in the 
garbage. Wait, why didn't you? I must have done it too far. Okay, we're getting there. Fishing on unlucky days is awful. And I was facing the wrong. Are you kidding me? Stop it. I'm just glad I can fish on my farm and actually get fish and not just garbage. I don't know what that is that keeps showing up, but it really wants to uh, swim around out here. I'm not worried about those fish. They're not worth the time right now. Ah, uh, I was so close to her. Green. Okay. Sell that. Or not sell it. Just throw it away. We can get in some more fishing. Whoa. That was weird. <laughs> I hate when that happens, and I don't know how I triggered it to do it, but it's, it's an accident for sure. Well, we're getting there slowly but surely. What is our fishing? We're almost halfway to level two of fishing. Almost. I don't know how many fish actually qualify for it. Like, oh crap. Oh well. Like, obviously, trash doesn't do much gives you like a sliver of a level. I kind of wish I knew like exact numbers. Oh, oops. Oh well. Um, and I think like I know it depends how many fish mm -hmm. you catch like perfect compared to uh like just catching them. Mm -hmm. But I wonder if it has to go off of the level as well of the fish, like the star value of it. Okay, I'm just picking up junk now. Which is fine, but not ideal. There we go. Oops. Stupid fish. There we go. Okay, I'm not too worried about fishing anymore. I'm, yeah, I'm at the halfway point to two, which is, which is good. Um, I'm gonna keep all these Georgia Colas because it's probably just worth it. I'll keep the bait. Everything else can be sold. Not a great fishing haul, but it's something, which is better than nothing. Uh, I think we already did that one. Okay. Yes, sleep for the night. Not bad. It wasn't a great day, but it was better. There's not much you can do when it's an unlucky day. Okay. We're almost to full hearts with people. Weather. It's gonna be sunny. Living off the land. Tell me about fences. And it's a luck like it's a lucky day. It's a good day. So worth going. I feel like it's not worth going in the mines. It's gonna be worth fishing. And just spending a lucky day fishing. I know the mines are great for like 
getting stuff from people and upgrading my everything, but I kind of want to upgrade my pick. So I think we're going to fish as much as I don't want to fish all day. We'll talk to everyone in town and we'll fish. Oops. Also, the more money I make, the sooner I can get upgrades on everything. We are going to take um, just some food. Also take one parsnip. Um, and we're going to fish somewhere else, but I want... Uh, there's no point. Never mind. We're just... We're gonna head out. We're gonna go to the beach. And we're gonna fish. That way we can get stuff kind of going money wise. Oh, look, a quest. Watch it be in the mines where I'm not going today. A green bean. <laughs> I'm, I don't have beans, Haley. I'm not growing beans. Don't ask for them beans. I don't want her to hurt me forever for beans anyways. I have more important things to deal with. Like making money so I can take over Stardew Valley and buy my boy Sebastian all the gifts he could ever want. That's what we're here for. Nothing else. Fishing. Hopefully we get good stuff. What's up, Lily? How are ya? Good? Nope. Is he going to open the shop? Perfect, because I'm gonna have to sell it to you. That's what I'm gonna be doing soon. <clears throat> Uh, fish and got all excited. I don't think I've had one like perfect fish yet this game. That's fine. It's okay. Um, people in Stardew Valley won't start moving around until closer to two, so we can fish most of the morning. I don't like fishing in Stardew Valley, but I want the money. That's all I want is the money. Let them fish. Just some money. I mean, eventually I'm gonna have to fish when I have the kitchen gonna be the easiest way. Mm -hmm. I forget how much a kitchen upgrade is. I think it's 10,000? Maybe. I don't remember. Mm -hmm. I need to fish a bit. There are bubbles. I'll get there. So far, so good. Not doing terribly so far this morning. Okay. What fishies are in here? That's a really bad angle. I don't know if I can actually... What? There's like no way to... Yeah, no. I'm not even gonna sit and try. Screw those bubbles. I'm not wasting any more time with it. My attention span is short. Okay. Come on, fish. Come on. There we go. Ooh. Oh, the chest. 
I wanted the chest too much. Of course. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Fishing. Is... I don't know. It's not terrible, but it's not like my ideal way to spend an entire day in the game. Especially not at low levels. Low level fishing is not fun. I want the upgraded hole so bad so I can bait and all the bobbers and it makes life easier. We'll get there eventually. I like fish that do that. Just sit there. Okay. Well, wait, I want to sell. Take all the fish. There we go. And the whole... All that. Oh, and then I can rebuy what you just took from me. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh, I can't do that while I'm... I can't open any menus while I'm fishing. I want to see if anyone's kind of moved around yet. Gotta have some, some chats with our people. Let's see. All of them are in their home. Penny is where she usually is. Emily hasn't moved to the saloon yet. And Lee is up there. Where's Elliot? Elliot is it's just out. Let's go talk to Elliot real fast. Elliot! Get our, our chats in. I'm kind of new to this town myself, but I really feel at home. I moved here only a year before you- oh. Proof that I just don't talk to everyone in town enough. Like, I- I knew Elliot was, like, new to town, but I didn't realize, like, he was only been here, like, a year. I thought he'd been, like, in Stardew Valley a bit longer. The more you know. Uh, Grandma Evelyn. What's up? Oh my, what a lovely day. Oh, I want to go see what's her face. Hey. Hey, my my lady. I wish Abigail wouldn't spend so much time in her room. She's playing video games. She could be doing much worse. Here, take this. Yes, yes, I'm sure. I want us to be friends. Harvey. We sell a few over-the-counter medi medicines at the clinic. Feel free to stop by if you're feeling exhausted. I know that being a farmer is pretty tiring work. Don't overdo it. I'm not buying your medicine because it's expensive. And I don't have that kind of money. Maintaining a household is, a, is difficult work, but somebody has to do it. Yes. Oh, yes. What is... Yeah, so I haven't gifted Enthalyn anything, and just talking to her has us at almost a heart, so it does help. It's a wonderful gift. How much did that give us a heart with Evelyn? Almost. Okay. We need to just, like... I kind of underestimated how much chatting with people actually helped. I want to be just like my big brother when I grow up. Okay, bye. <laughs> Another Joe Cola. Uh, Sam is not in its house, which means he's lurking around probably over by that tree <laughs> that he's usually at. No, I don't want to drink the Joe Cola. That is a whole fish. Okay. I forgot it's a, like a lucky day, so he's not there. Where's Sam? Where is he? How did I lose Sam? Oh, Sam's working. What's Margaret? Let's see what she has to say. 
Whenever I'm struggling with a technical problem, I always take a walk. It's surprising how much the change in scenery can help. Good to know. Nothing there. Nothing there. What's happening in here? Sam's lift- or Sam. Alex's lifting more weights. I'm not much of a talker, especially not to strangers if you don't mind me saying. Oh, fine. Your wife and I are becoming best friends. Ugh. I can't be mad at him. He's just grumpy. Oh, hey. Taking a break from work. Yep. Sure am. I mean... Is it really work if I just leave my farm to go talk to everyone and fish for a little bit? I don't think it is. Okay. Demetrius is outside. I'll talk to you soon, Demetrius, but I, I gotta go find Sebastian. I don't- I think he left his room already. No. Shoot. I think I missed Sebastian for the day. Nope, Sebastian, let me in. I have a fishing pole. <laughs> Shoot. That's not good. Okay. I heard that Lewis showed you around the community center. It'd be great if you could fix that place up. It used to be a real nice building. You, mm. See, ma'am, I'm gonna be working for George Mart again soon, so don't get your hopes up. Okay, we're gonna have to talk to Sebastian another day, which does kind of suck. Mario helps me out in the lab. Sometimes. She's a good kid. I'm very glad. Okay, Robin left her house. Linus. The crisp air of the wilderness is all I care to know. I live here by choice. Uh, I'm sure you do. I'm not telling you anything else. Or any other stuff. You're fine. I'm here to see if Sebastian's decided to leave his room or if he ever plans to. Sebastian! I need to say hello to you today. This is important. I need to know if you're going to talk to me about frogs. But this is also for our hearts. I'm close to, to, to one full heart with you. One more conversation would do it. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Let's see. Um, let's. I'm gonna look up his schedule real fast. But I think I missed my chance to talk to him. No, maybe not. If he doesn't go to his couch. Oh, he did it. See, persistence. Persistence was apparently the key for me right now. Hi. Um, need something. God dang it. You're... Mm. I'm frustrated with you, sir. You can't give me better dialogue. I, I need better dialogue from you. I know I haven't gifted you many things yet. I don't have nice things yet. I can't give you the things that you want yet. I don't even know what those things... How much I can actually give you yet. I don't have a kitchen to make you food in. I totally looked and glanced at the scarecrow, thinking not that it was just a person, but I legitly looked at it and was like, why is Pam on my farm? It's not Pam. It's a scarecrow. Jeez. Okay. Let's um, sell. Oh, thank you so much for the lurk. Okay. We're, we're selling a Jojo ball. I have like four other trash ones for uh, Sam in the chest. It's fine. It's only 8 p.m. and I have some energy. So let's go cut down a tree. What do you do when you have too much energy? You cut down a tree, apparently. That's what's important. Kind of. Trying to clean up this mess of a place. Really? I wasn't cutting it. Okay, 
Okay, so we made some progress. Not much progress. We made a little progress today. I'll just send her to bed early. We'll attempt to chat with Sebastian tomorrow. I just, I don't have anything right now to gift him. I know, I feel exhausted. I don't particularly want to feel exhausted, but I have no choice in the matter now, do I? I'll throw some stuff in. We'll just keep it. Screw it, we'll keep it, and we'll be on our way. Grandpa, scoot over. It's bedtime. I will... I always forget what I name the cats or the, the pet in game and I just feel like Grandpa was the best name that I could have figured out because I'll never forget. Ever. <laughs> okay. Check this. It is an unlucky day. Great. Clear and sunny. Annoyed. Everything's screaming at me to go into the mines, and I just don't want to. I'm avoiding it still. I know I shouldn't. I know that's where I'm gonna get important things. But I just don't want to. I still have to clean up more of the farm. Let's see, fill up that and water what very few crops we have. Because I want to save some money for Egg Festival, which, when is Egg Festival? It's not map. It's this. Okay, Egg Festival isn't until the 13th. Tomorrow is Vincent's birthday, and I feel like I should give the boy a gift. I have nothing for this child, though. Which isn't great. I don't even know really what Vincent likes, except for things I don't have access to right now. Like grapes. I know he likes grapes and, um, what is it? Uh, the... I can't remember what it is. Uh, cranberry candy or something. Those are like the only two gifts I really remember him liking. Besides like, you know, like the pink cake or that kind of thing. So, he probably will not get a birthday gift from me this year, but that's, that's fine. I don't want to spend all my money either just yet on this pick. Uh, oh, but I do need my pick. That's what I was doing. I think that's, yeah. I want to go check, um, the stuff over here. And see if there's any new things to mine. Yes, there is. I didn't bring my hoe over here, but it'll just be clay anyway, so not a big deal. I can at least pick up this stuff. I mean, I guess it's going to be another day of partially fishing, but that's not... I don't know. It's not my ideally what I want to do. I just need money. Okay. How much do I have? Two. I have two. <laughs> just two. <laughs> Great. I had no mail, like no, no, no questy booze, no nothing. Okay. Um, let's do, we'll make sure we talk to everyone, we'll fish, we'll pick up some stuff, um, yay, foraging level up, that's nice, I don't remember what that gives me, but it's worth having, so. Oh, also, Sailor Zoom, thank you so much for the follow. I'm sorry I missed that. I don't know how I missed it. Unless it was when I was fishing and then I was completely zoned out of everything. <laughs> but thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay. 
uh, the beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. You gotta spend some time in the sun or else you'll get all pale. We had this conversation. Do you wanna hang out with me at the beach sometime? It's like, he is all about being up in my business. I, how friendly are we? I have not gifted this boy nothing. We're almost to four. Well, you see, that's what, that's what happens. Is when you talk to people, they just, in this game, they, Lewis, you saw nothing. Sniff, sniff. Ah, I sense you've been spending time in the community center. It's a good to know someone's taking care of the place. I'm concerned that you knew... Wait, I haven't been at the community center, so I don't know what he smells on me. But I would prefer if he wasn't trying to sniff me. That would be... That was uncomfortable. I prefer if he didn't do that. Okay, everyone's still... Um, oh my gosh, it's Tuesday. I think I can get into their house, but I can't get anything from Robin. Because they're all going to go do their exercise time. My nephew Shane has been staying at my place the last few months. He helps out with the chickens, and I'm not complaining. You know, that's great. I'm really happy that he does. He needs those chickens, because they're probably the only thing he's nice to. Nice makeup. Oh. Wait, are you even wearing any? I take that as a compliment. I'm bored. <laughs> so am I, Haley. I'm bored of your shenanigans. The one time I don't have a gift for Sam. It's good to see you again. Take it easy. God dang. I meant to... I've had gift... I've had so many Jojo Colas in my pocket for him. Oh, Vincent is sad. Oh, is it Vincent's birthday? <laughs> oh my gosh, I keep sitting in your couch. Mom won't let me have any more gummies today. Every day. Let's see if anyone has any good trash. No, they don't. No good garbage. Dang. I guess I could talk to Evelyn. Evelyn's always a nice person to talk to. And George. <laughs> Looks like another gloomy day. George... I think you're the gloomy one. Don't I'm my husband, George. He isn't very friendly to strangers. If you get to know him better, he'll warm up to you. I, I honestly... I'm sure you two could become great friends one day. Since you're so interested in my husband, I'll let you in on a little secret. He really likes leeks. You can find them in the mountains this time of year. Oh my gosh, I forgot. I need to go find some leeks. I want to be the bestest friends with George because I never have been and I just want to see what happens. My curiosity has peaked. It, it, it really is. So we'll just pick some of this stuff. For some leaks. Have you come to ridicule me? No! Linus always thinks the worst of me. Um, it is almost two. Which means Sebastian should be leaving his room soon. This valley has a very vibrant and diverse ecosystem. That's one reason I'm excited to live here. I know that. We're at one full heart with Sebastian. Oh, snap. I still need to be two to get into his room as I please. But he should be leaving soon. Or does he not leave until three? Maybe it's three. If he doesn't move at two o'clock, I'll run outside and fish for like a, a, like two minutes. And then we'll come back. Yep, it's three o'clock. I'll be back. Sebastian, give me an hour. I'll come talk to you in, in an hour. Catch some fish. Maybe one fish. And then we'll look at them. Might actually be able to get away with like two. 
maybe even three toward that. An achievement for fishing. Even better. I say that and then I catch absolutely nothing. Anytime now. There we go. Slowly but surely I will catch this fish. Yes. Ooh, and I leveled up my fishing even better. Okay, it's three o'clock. <laughs> I'm catching all those fish. But now I have a bigger fish to catch. Sebastian. I was thinking, people are like, oh. People are like stone, skipping over the water. Eventually we're going to sink. Yes, I know, my brooding, brooding soul. Goodness. How much more did that give us? None. Okay, so now I have to start gifting the boy stuff for him to actually want to be friends with me. Great. trying to remember who I'll have to do some research because I know one of Sebastian's easiest gifts will be once I can get the kitchen in the house is uh getting him this this sashimi to cook for him I just don't remember who gives me the recipe uh Stardew Valley is it's a lot of fun. I'm playing with quite a few mods. Um, so it is slightly different than just the original, in a sense. Um, but it's a very chill game. It's a lot of fun just to, you know, zone out, wander around, talk to people. In my case, follow around the same person until they want to be my friend. There we go. But I, I'm fishing for all the money I can get right now. If I can catch this fish. There we go. Anything good. Okay, that will be good to give to Gunther, which I could take to him now, actually. Let's just take that to him now. To the museum. Um, but now I need to... Oh, have you met my mother? She's the town's carpenter. Yes, I know she is. I've met her. One of the first people I met, actually. I need to chat with everyone. Gotta be friends with the people. What? What do you want? Go away. Oh my gosh. I'm I'm gonna find you in the saloon later and I'm gonna buy you a beer so you're nicer to me. Jeez. He's so cranky. No, what? That was not cool. Really? I was here in time. In this case, the tables will turn eventually. Um, I'm actually, I have downloaded uh, a mod for Sebastian, the character I'm following around, that ultimately will turn him into a Yandri. So he will soon be stalking me, I'm sure. Um, but I have to get the hearts up before I start getting all that lovely new dialogue that I'm waiting for. So, <laughs> I guess this is what pushes him to it. <laughs> this is going to just absolutely push him over the edge. Throw that away. Let's get a gift for our dear Shane. Yes, I know it's your favorite. Of course I do. Uh, we'll talk to everyone real fast. 
Willie, I'm honestly, you know what? I'll spend some money and buy Willie a beer too because I like Willie. Willie's polite. Pam, I'm not buying you another round. Relax and enjoy yourself and uh, Emily, I know you work here because I see you here. Actually here. Have a flower. Positive energy. Perfect. We love it. Okay. I feel like that's all I can really do for that. How long have I been streaming on Twitch? Um, in total? Um... Uh, I have to count how many it, it hasn't been a year yet I started last August so not too long not too terribly long but uh, we'll get rid of those rocks get rid of that horseradish I don't need that um but yeah I've just recently returned to streaming. Um, I took roughly a month or two just kind of off because I was streaming so much I burnt myself out. So I took a break and then I came back and I'm really happy to be back. I'm having a lot of fun. Yes, money. Okay, mountain fish are definitely going to make me more money. I forget that sometimes. So, mountain fishing is the way to go. I have to go in the mines, though. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it was nice to take a break, but I, I miss it a lot. I love streaming. It's so much fun. <laughs> uh, pretty day, and oh, great. It's an awful day. <laughs> the spirits are displeased with every action I make. Oh. Hi, me sell hats. Okay, poke. Come to old, old, old house, poke. Bring coins. Hat mouse. Oh, I love hat mouse. There's another letter. What's this letter? Dear Farmer Luna, I'd like to apologize for joking about your grandpa's old cottage when we first met. It's really a nice little house. However, you might need some more space someday. That's where I can help. If you bring me some raw materials and pay a fee, I can expand your house. The first expansion I offer includes a kitchen. With a kitchen, you'll be able to cook any recipe you've learned. Anyways, I hope you're starting to feel at home in Stardew Valley. Your local carpenter, Robin. Robin, you're listening in on my conversations, apparently. Ah, Grandpa Cat. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter. When I pick these, I'm not looking for gold level stuff I'm looking to sell them. Whoops. And apparently slap the scarecrow in the process. Do -do. Selling all the stuff. Well, I have two spots left. That's fine. That's fine. I would like to open the chest. Please and thank you. Let's see. We will fill this with water and then oh no the cat's melting grandpa's melting oh no um i for right now i'm probably only going to be streaming um sunday a tuesday and thursday nights 10 p.m. Eastern time um, is when I'll start. And then it just kind of depends on how long I kind of feel up to streaming. Uh, tonight is actually going on way longer than I thought I would stream for. Um, so I'll probably do one more day in game and call it a night. But yeah, three nights a week. Um, I'm gonna update my schedule. Yes, Eastern time. I love it. Um, I'll update my schedule here. 
because I think it's empty. I think I only have it for Sundays right now. But yes, I will update and keep it kind of more updated uh, now that I have something a little more set. Let's see, let's sell these. I have to keep a few for, for snacks. There we go. That will make me a small chunk of money. I can go give one to uh, Carolyn. That will be good. And then I can keep the rest for myself. That's what I was going to do. Ooh, another quest. Please be something better than someone asking me for a green bean. I'm running low on anchovies. If someone could bring me one, it would be much appreciated. Sure, I will try and fish you up an anchovy. Okay, Carolyn is not getting her gift today because the store is closed. Looks like a good day to play catch. If you weren't a girl, I'd ask you to play catch. Um, Alex, we're about to throw down. What does that mean? Ugh, never mind. I'm gonna throw that football into his face, I swear. Oh, Alex. I know he has a good storyline if you get through it, but like, that boy is, I will fight him. He is one of those characters that like, I know I should try because I've seen his storyline and it can be really cute. But also, like, he makes me want to fight. <laughs> Ooh, reward. what I get? Gunther, is it a pony? It's melon seeds. I need those for next season, so that's fine. I will take those and be very happy with them. Penny, we don't have school here. Have a school here, but I'm doing my best to give Vincent and Jazz a proper education. Every child deserves a chance to be successful. Jazz is very good at math and reading. Vincent is good at... Well, he has an active imagination. Poor Vincent. Miss Penny says I have to read this book before I can go play. He looks like he's about to cry. Miss Penny's... Oh, and he just says it again. Poor little Vincent. You must read to be smarter. And Jazz refuses to talk to me. One day, she might actually talk to me. Possibly. Possibly not. Um, okay, Sam is out and about. Ugh, dang. He saw me. Don't, don't, I wasn't even digging through your trash can. Like, it could have been worse. I could have been in your garbage can, but I was in your neighbor's. Where are they going? I don't recall them going places together. Did you watch the game last night? Or do you even have a TV? I have a TV, thank you. <laughs> what did you say? It's 11.40 a.m. already, my goodness. I still have a ton of work to do. I'm questioning where you guys are going. I'm kind of interested, actually. I was gonna go get Sam a gift, but now I'm just like, are you guys going grocery shopping together? Or just hiding out in the back of the saloon? Oh, I thought they were going to George and Evelyn's. I was confused, but they're not. They must be going to the store. Uh, times have been tough lately. I got laid off my job as a bus driver. If I got that job back, I could drive you to Calgo Desert. Pam, if you got that job back, would you stop drinking as much? I feel as a bus driver, you probably shouldn't drink the amount you do. Uh, just for the safety of everybody. <laughs> then again, not many people take the bus. No, she shouldn't drink when she's driving the bus, actually. I'm back. I don't have any good gifts for him. But I'm back. What's up? I was just daydreaming about- You're always daydreaming about carpentry projects. You're doing okay with your place. How's it going? It's great. Um, 
I'm more so here to talk to your son, but I know he will not leave his dwelling yet. Tuesdays and Thursdays, I work at Harvey's clinic. He says he likes having me around in case his medical equipment goes haywire. Being a farmer must be pretty easy, huh? Excuse me? No. You're probably growing up. No, Demetrius. I'm really not. Sebastian, I'm back. I'll be back in three. Now, if I was a leak, where would I be? Those are horseradishes. Oh, thank you so much. That means a lot. I've I've put a lot of work into my desk setup, so I uh, I really appreciate the compliment. Thank you. Okay, we'll walk this way. Any more leaks? I have one leak now that I can give to George. Mario is leaving. I will fish up one fish, and then I will go back and find Sebastian. So I can talk to him, and he will tell me nothing of importance. Mm -hmm. But that's okay. <laughs> Will Sebastian be mad if I give him, like, a parsnip? Will that upset him? It might. I never know what will upset him. I, also, I wish I knew what the mod was to press the button to see what people like. <laughs> Okay. Another fish. I need this fish for money. Perfect. Oh, and it was a was it a perfect catch? Awesome. We had a 390. Ah, Sebastian. I might just give you another flower just to anger you. What am I going to do today? Probably nothing. Here, you want a flower? Question mark. Run away. I don't know how he takes that. I don't know if he likes the flowers, but I have a leaf for George and that's what matters. George, I'm coming to be your best friend. I brought the goods. Don't be mad at me. I need friendship. George. Not you, Mayor Lewis. You're too young compared to George. George, this is for you. This is my favorite thing, thank you. Alex is my grandson. Have I told you that already? No, but I caught the gist of it. <gasps> Speak up. I feel bad that your grandson's Alex. Maybe you should hit him with a football instead of me. Evelyn, have I talked to you today? No, I haven't. I saw the most beautiful family of butterflies sunning themselves in the town garden yesterday. I'm so glad for you, Evelyn. Truly, I am. Harvey, what do you have to say today? <laughs> Always so stubborn. Remember to cover your mouth when you sneeze. Any more wise words, Harvey, then make sure to wash your hands. Oh, Harvey, you give such sage advice to all of us of the valley. What a doctor. Goodness gracious. Oh, all the children are going back home. Oh, look, it's Elliot. I haven't talked to Elliot in a couple of days. The forest is a wonderful place. Have you been there? It depends. Which forest are we talking about? The secret one? Because there's a, a log in the way. So, no. Oh, okay. Um, I assume Willie is not in there. Yeah, Willie is not in his business dwelling. I couldn't think of the word I was trying to say. That's okay. I have to catch an anchovy for, for someone. I don't even remember who the quest is for. Anchovy? That's not an anchovy. Hopefully an anchovy. Hopefully a fish. 
Oh, it's for Jody. That's who wanted the anchovy. That's who it was. Oh. I have a feeling I'm not going to catch it. If I do, it would be really dumb luck. So, let's see. Even if I catch it, I can't give it to her today. Because she does not go to the saloon like all the other people in town do. Which, I always wondered why Caroline and Jody don't go to the saloon. Because it, it's not because they have kids. That is definitely not the reason. Because Marnie takes care of Jazz and you know she's going to the saloon to be all flirty with Mayor Lewis. And Shane's at the saloon every night too. So Jazz is at home alone. And I know that Jody isn't like, oh, I'm not going to the saloon because I have a child. I have Vincent. Like, no, that is not the reason. So now I'm more just like, I wonder why they don't. I think those two characters, out of any characters, are the two that need to be able to go out and like have some fun. Honestly, this game really does. It has a lot more, like, weird, like, plot and story parts to it than you would really think. Like, each character has such a backstory that you learn about as you, like, become their friends and all that kind of stuff. It, it's kind of crazy. And then there's so many mods that people have made that just, like, add to it. It, it it's wild. Okay. I just need an anchovy. But I don't think I'm gonna get it. If I don't catch the anchovy this time, I'm not gonna try anymore. It's the last try. Please be an anchovy. Like, it would be so nice if it was, but it's not. I'm not gonna hope for it. Really. Come on. Come on, fish. Yeah, that's not an anchovy. Um. Oh 30. Ooh, okay. Get rid of that. We'll keep that one. We're gonna sell that. Well, it was lovely chatting with you, uh, Willie, but, uh, the fish just aren't biting tonight. At least not the fish I need. Oh, cutscene. Poor Linus. Linus gets such, like, crap for digging through the garbage, and I'm over here just doing it in broad daylight. No shame. Er, sounds like those raccoons are back again. Filthy varmints. Ah, <sighs> uh, you turned up at the right moment, miss. Could you do an old man a favor? Could you go around the corner and scare off those raccoons for me? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks. Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. And there goes George. No. Linus. It was me. I'm sorry. Oh. I find a lot of hot, fresh food in these cans. Stuff that would go to waste if I didn't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with that? Uh, yes, it's disgusting. No, it's a shame for food to go to waste. Yes, it's illegal. That's George's private property. No, but you should get a job and stop leeching off others. Uh, no, it's a shame for food to go to waste. Thanks. I knew you were an open-minded person. I feel good about what I'm doing. I'm not harming anyone. At least truly not. There's no police in Stardew Valley. They can't stop me from telling him it's okay. <laughs> you can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's can anymore. You can tell him he's scared off the raccoons for good. I 
I mean, most people in Stardew Valley just get mad at me for doing it. They're like, ew, and then they forget all about it. I can't tell them not to do it if I'm doing it, too. Wait. No, Lioness. I know what you were doing, Lioness. Dramatic pause. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican Town to go hungry. Yes, Gus. Be the best ever. Here, I've got a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in my spicy marinara. Go on, take it. I love it. Gus is such a, like, nice person. Oh, Abigail's having a moment. Let's chat with her. Hey, sorry in advance if I say anything rude. I didn't get much sleep last night. What? What do you want? <laughs> she literally says something rude right afterwards. See, I could dig through that trash can, but Abigail will be offended if I do it. I think there are a few characters that don't mind if they catch you. Like, I would assume Lioness, like, because he's never in town, but if he would be, he wouldn't, like, care. Um, I tried to dig through the garbage in front of Clint earlier in the game, and either he didn't notice or he wasn't close enough. But I also, I feel like I've gone through the garbage can in front of Emily and she didn't care. Like, she didn't say anything about it, as far as I remember. So, I think it all just depends on the person and how they kind of feel about it. Okay, put that in there. I think that's all I can really do for this day. I guess we'll go cut down some more trees to get out the last of this energy that she has. Actually, we'll clean up up here because it is not cute. I don't know what I'm going to put up here. Maybe I'll put chickens up here when I can get chickens. That would be fun. Oh, I don't have a... I'll have to just do this. That's fine. We'll take out this tree, too. Yeah, I need to make torches for sure. Which I should be able to do. Gosh, I don't have anything to break the grass except for the axe. This is awful. What is that? I guess it's just something already, like, on the ground. This is using up energy that I didn't want to use. Oops. There we go. Get rid of this tree. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put chickens over here, maybe. Please break this. Yeah. Let's make... Some torches real fast. Put one over there. And, well, if I can. There, we'll just do that. I can actually see up here. I know, it's, it's only 12. You're fine. You're fine. And then, okay, now you're exhausted, and now we should go back. <laughs> okay, put everything away. Uh, we'll fill this up real fast, too, so I have it ready for the next day. Really? I was going to be real mad if that caused me to be exhausted. There's gonna be problems. Uh, checked everything there. Okay. We will sleep for the night. That was actually the most profitable day I've had, and it was because of the parsnips. And the well, and the fish. The fish made some good money too. Okay. We'll do that so we can save game. Day 11 of spring. Lovely. So we will... I am going to 
uh, stop here, which made it pretty far. It's day 11 of spring. We got two days until egg festival. So I should save up some money for when that comes around. Um, and then we have flower dance, which I don't think we're going to have any high enough romance to dance with anyone at uh, flower dance. But um, yeah, I will come back and play this. Honestly, I have a feeling I'm going to come back and end up playing this Thursday night. Um, just because I'm kind of invested in this mod and wanting to get a little bit more through it. I've had one different dialogue so far and now I really want to know what else is going to happen. So Thursday night we will work on uh, really romancing that Sebastian. And of course, you know, hopefully I will have the funds to uh, slowly start taking over the valley with Jojmart, but we'll see. Um, yeah, so let me plug that there. Um, I will update on my Instagram stories or my Twitter when I go live. Or if something comes up and I have to cancel stream or change the time, anything like that, it will be posted there. But you can find me all these other places as well. And yeah, I will be back Thursday night, 10 p.m. Eastern time. And we'll play more Sturdy Valley. Um, I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your night. And I'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.